Ken Demev, Chief Experience Officer, is with me right now. Could you tell me what you think the greatest benefit is of these scientific sessions? The greatest value for the scientific sessions is being able to dedicate time to learning uh, while, they're he while our, our members and attendees are here. Uh, they, they learn from the sessions, the, the enormous amount of sessions that we have available to them during this period, and also the great uh, partners that we have on our exhibit floor. But more importantly, and they tell us this every year, that, that they learn from each other while they're here. The face-to-face -face time that they get with their peers, peers they've known before, new people they met, that incidental time that they just happen to be involved with conversations around things they may or may not have intended to learn about, but do. So that kind of incidental exchange of ideas is extremely valuable for those who come here. And that's why they you know, travel halfway across the, the world to be here with us. Talk to me about what you think the society is doing very well and things that you think maybe it can improve upon. Well, the best thing about the Heart Rhythm Society is its members. Our members are very passionate about what they do. And so what you see at scientific sessions is their dedication towards making this a great event. I mean, they spend the time to teach each other the things that they've learned, that they've learned from others, and, and they share that. And they do it with such uh, great passion for, for the field that it, it, it's hard to, to not you know, absorb that when you're here and, and, and transfer that to others. So we have very loyal attendees, we have very loyal uh, faculty and um, participants in this, in this scientific sessions. That's what we do well, is really the exchange of knowledge between members. Where do you see the strategic vision of the society heading? One of the strategic areas that we need to, to um, continue to grow in is our global reach. Um, you know, we started as the North American uh, so Society for Electrophysiology, but we've become the Heart Rhythm Society in order to serve the world. And if you saw at our plenary this morning, we talk about that global view. I mean, we're a global society in general, we're becoming more of a global society, and, and it's uh, evident with scientific sessions that our attendees are nearly 40 percent of our attendees are from outside of the U.S. So we're seeing that exchange of knowledge in a global fashion. How do we uh, bring technology and bring expertise and, and knowledge to those areas of the world that need it and, and exchange you know, new ideas that are happening uh, with different uh, parts of the, the globe to, to learn more. Thank you so much.